it off! I need a new best buddy! <gasps> no! Never! Never, boss! <laughs> hey, what's that? Instant giant hideous friend DNA! Oh, look at Daisy! I love Daisy! Hello, the little friend. Ah! I think he likes me. Go! Pillage! Rampage! Have fun, but be back by eight. You know how I wear it. It looks like that mutant's headed towards the forest. We should take a closer look before it destroys the island. Emma, I think I'm picking something up. Hyperman! Not now, Emma. There's something out there. I know. I'm looking at it. Don't move. We have to determine whether or not it's... Dangerous. I'll go with dangerous. Hyperman, if we don't do something, it'll destroy the island. And you're sure that's bad? Well, of course it is. Okay, I'll I'll take care of this right now. Hyperman, I don't think that's such a good idea. I almost had him, you know. Right. Let's get back to the lab. Before Inter mutated this thing, it had predictable behaviors and defenses. Maybe we can figure out how to defeat it. Daisies! Entro loves daisies! We'll take him to the trap! Emma? I don't want to fight that thing again. Maybe we better just build our own mutant. You can't just make a mutant. It takes time to evolve. Ah, uh, how much time would that be? According to standard Darwinian theory... A couple of minutes? Before the game's over? About a million years. <gasps> a million years! Holy schmoly bully! That's a lot, isn't it? If there was just some way to speed up the evolutionary process inside the terrarium. But that would mean speeding up time. Hey, hey, hey! Speeding up time! That's easy! Sucking a peanut butter sandwich through a straw. That's tough. But time! No problem! I'll just hypertize it with my PDA! <laughs> A change in one or more bases of DNA results in a mutation. Generally, the natural rate of mutation is low, but mutation frequency can be increased by such factors as ionizing radiations and mutagenic compounds. That's cool, Hyperman! Now that the evolutionary process has been speeded up, adjust the temperature and water in the terrarium, and click the time bar to see the evolutionary changes over millions of years. Then we'll examine what happens to the animals and insects. Where I come from, dragon vipers, our tough little vipers. That's our mutant. Let's go. <laughs> Look at the size of that stone frog. That's, that's, bigger than mom! Let's go! Ow! 
A Megamorph Snail! Emma, the answer to our dreams! Hold my heart and give me a tutu. That's a frog eating snake, or my name's Fred. It's a coniferous climber. That thing would be great in the forest. It can like climb up the trees, jump down and surprise Entro's mutant. <laughs> a red-faced skillfish. Let's go. Personally, I prefer my snails with mango, but I think it'll do. They're very dangerous, and you have to know just how to control them. All right, frog, get going! That usually does it. That's a holler squirrel. You can tell by the way they gently and subtly call to one another. It goes something like this. Hey, 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 it's a look down fish. Look at the size of that stone frog! That's... that's... Alright, I got my last guy loaded up in the PDA. I'm ready to go! It's time to kick some mutant tush! Alright, it's obvious he's afraid. He's not gonna show up. Unless, of course, he's back there in that suspicious-looking round building that says Coliseum on it. Ladies, gentlemen, and intergalactic visitors, it's time for a no holds barred contest between Emperor's Terminator and Hyperman's Thing. Now, let's get ready to rumble! down before they destroy something else. We've got their mutant. We should put them in the trap. No, no, it can't be. This is terrible. Uh, what's it mean? It means we better find out what's going on there. Let's check for intro on the PDA. 